Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Welcome back to my YouTube channel here, where we are going through Mass Effect 2, part of the Mass Effect Legendary Edition. Thank you for joining me for part 5. And we are ready to go talk to the Elusive Man and head to Horizon. Well, I mean, we don't know that if we're playing this for the first time, but, you know, this is not a blind playthrough. So, um, quick, a few housekeeping things real quick. As I mentioned in the end of the last video, we are going to, um, this video will just be Horizon and probably the Fallout. We'll go talk to uh, some folks on the ship um, afterwards, and then I'll stop the video. And then I'll go right into part six. I'll make two different videos of that, just so it's, from a continuity standpoint, it'll it'll be a little easier that way um, on the playlist. Um, haven't decided what direction I'm going to be taking in, in part six yet, if we're, if we're going to go straight into recruiting or if we're going to go into some of the loyalty missions um, because I know that you can start some of those quickly. I did mention possibly doing the um, Shadow Broker DLC uh, fairly early on um, and that's probably going to still hold true. Um, I, I usually like to do that before the, uh, the before we go to the mission where we uh, uh, where we go into the collector ship. So, which is about the horizon is about the third mark of the uh, one third of the way through the game. The, that ship, the ship is about two thirds of the way through the game. So, I usually like to go through it in that middle section of the game um, and have it before I start doing a lot of the loyalty missions. So, anyway, um, thanks for joining me today. Uh, no one's on, no one's live with me here right now, but that's okay. If you're catching this on the replay, I do appreciate it. I am starting to see a few more views on my videos, so. Maybe there's a few people out there watching, or maybe not. It doesn't really matter. It's totally fine. All right, let's go talk to the Elusive Man. Shepard, I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morden delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies, but they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew? I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you, especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the Professor. Aye, aye, Commander. Tell me you have something. Yes. Lilith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. 
What is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run! This is like <clears throat> Nightmare Factory. Oh no, Nightmare Factory. I hate the collectors. I just hate them so much. I'm at the Morbid. Let's get out of here. <laughs> we are the harbinger of their perfection. Prepare these humans for ascension. Oh, big, big nope. All right, we're going to take Morden. We're incinerate. Um, oh goodness, what should we do here? Miranda would be helpful with her warp. Overload doesn't do anything on these guys. Shockwave and pull would be helpful. Let's go ahead and let's take Jack. I might regret this later, but. All right, yeah, let's do um, heavy shockwave for Jack. Yeah, let's do both of those. That way we can um, he can have two powers. Eviscerator shotgun. Let's take the missile launcher, locust, and sizer. Yeah, we're good here. <laughs> Sure, these armor upgrades will protect us from the seeker swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. In theory? Experimental technology. Only test is contact with seeker swarms. Have to test them in person. Should be exciting. Destroy you! 
Massive ship. Commander, we're getting all interference. We can't maintain it. Collector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. Incinerate does more damage to barriers than I thought it would. <clears throat> Collectors answer to the Reapers. Alright, let's go on through here and find some stuff to loot real quick and then we'll uh, we'll head on. Don't want to miss anything. Okay, I think we're good there. We can't get up there yet. That's the next spot we go to. This is valuable. Heavy skin weave. Okay. Looks half human. Guess we know what happened to the colonists. No, no husk creation spikes. Collectors brought husks with them, taking colonists alive. Some other purpose. The collectors must be experimenting on the colonists. What are they up to? Sounds almost worse than what Cerberus did to me. Find out for sure when you stop them. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced, evolved. They still die when you shoot them. The collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Whatever you say, boss man. <laughs> Love Jack. Peaceful. Usually takes a lot of chemicals for me to get this kind of quiet. No signs of resistance. Must have happened quickly. Oh! oh. Shockwave is, uh, it is OP in Mass Effect 2. They nerfed it greatly in Mass Effect 3. I was really disappointed by, by the decision to do that. Okay, let's come up here, see what we can, see if there's anything to loot in here. There's a safe, but let's make sure we're not going to get shot while we're <coughs> exactly what I was afraid of. Anybody else? Okay. Oh, there's somebody else.
Okay. Now we can open up the safe. Credits. Okay, nothing in here. Appears conscious, fully aware, trapped in stasis. Fascinating. They've been like this a long time. Three thousand credits. Okay, now that we picked up the collector particle beam, we'll be able to uh, we'll be able to take on um, some of the heavy, some of the heavies. That Your form is fragile. I think we got everything here. Yeah, this... The one thing about not having Garrus or Miranda, I don't have a power that can punch through barriers. I gotta rely on weapons. Which is fine.
but Jack is going to be so helpful with her shockwave. Company, get out here, now. You're, you're human. What are you doing out here? You lead them right here. You had to hear them try to get in. Seems like it's hard to hide from the collectors. Those things are collectors? You mean, they're real? I thought they were just made up, you know, propaganda to keep us in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan, mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it's the Alliance's fault. Yeah. They stationed that Chief right. Williams yeah. here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. Right, yeah. Mm -hmm. Tell me more about this Alliance rep. Chief Williams? Heard she was some kind of hero or something. She it is a hero. To me, though. She's also my girlfriend. She just stayed back in council space. Any idea what she was doing on Horizon? Supposed to be helping us get the defense towers up and running. I got the feeling she was here for something else. Spying on us, maybe. Yeah, right. Mm hmm Tell me about the colony defense towers. A gift from the Alliance. High-powered Guardian lasers. Supposed to keep hostile ships from landing near the colony. Had to build a massive underground generator just to give it enough juice. Only we couldn't get the targeting systems online. So the Alliance gave us a giant gun that couldn't shoot straight. Stupid sons of bitches. Why do you think this is the Alliance's fault? We're just a small colony. Nobody bothered us before we started building those damn defense towers and drew attention to ourselves. I left council space to get away from the Alliance. Nothing good ever comes from getting mixed up with them. The Collectors are targeting remote colonies. The Alliance was trying to help. I don't need their help. Too many strings attached. That rep said she was just here to get the towers online, but mark my words, there's more to it. You're an idiot. I could, I'd put a bullet in your brain if I could. If you have defense, I can't you can stand morons like this. Ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. Shouldn't be hard to figure out. Just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. It's probably just better if you stay out of the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. You're an idiot. <laughs> Alright, we already got the weapons we need. Lawn mowers here. Incoming. Should do next. Not difficult. Okay, that was, uh, I 
hate fighting those scions. This Jack doesn't have the right weapon. Yeah. Good grief. You you guys gotcha. both need better weapons. Alright, let's let's take a look around, see if there's any any more loot we can grab. Doesn't look like it. Here's some power cells, but we don't need those. It'll just give us top off our ammo and give us credits. Right. This might be useful. Biotic damage. That'll be helpful for Jack. Surprised we haven't run across more frozen colonists. Colonists loaded onto ship. Collectors nearly finished here. Need to hurry. Yeah. I know. We need to hurry. But we have to loot first. We gotta find all the possible resources here. Here we go. Peter Access. 3,000 credits. Money is hard to come by in this game. Alright. I think we got it everything. Jack, uh, hit, hit those guys with a shockwave. I'll destroy you. Get in cover, Shepard. Good lord. Transmitter. Come on. There it is. Jeez, that took a little while. Normandy, you copy. Joker here. Signal sweet, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. Great. We play Piggy in the middle while she sorts out the batteries. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. 
All right. I'll kill you all. Assuming direct control. Morden, seriously. There is no pain. There is no fear. Screw it, you. I'm taking fire. One down. Bypassing fail saves and attempting emergency power up. Please hold the defense tower. Reinforcements likely. All right, everybody stick together here. Regroup over here. This is true power. Oh no, 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 no. Dang it. I got, I let him surround me. That was not. Oh geez, Harbinger's right there. Oh my gosh. More than kill him. Alright, that one's gone. All right, so I already did that part. Great, there's no cover back here. Well, we could get, we could take cover here. Sequential power up initiated. Guardian anti-ship batteries at forty. At least they won't be able to get around More us coming. here. We got their attention. Jack, shockwave. There we go.
Indeed. Let him come to us. This is the best. I think this is the best place for. I'm gonna switch to sniper rifle. Jack, where'd you go? Direct intervention is necessary. Kill that one. We are harmed. You will not be Shepard. I know where you I'll is. destroy you. This is true power. This hurts you. That's terrifying. Edie, we need that system online. Don't know what that is, but keep back. Just burn nicely. Thanks for wasting your power there, Morden. Get out of here, get out of here, Shepard. Melted it. There we go. Got it. Uh oh. Oh my gosh. That would destroy the colony. Let him 
get away? There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something. I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. No reason for regret, Shepard. Nobody else could do better. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard, Captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. Oh, the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. I thought you were dead, Shepard. We all did. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? We had something, Shepard. Something real. I... I loved you. I thought you were dead. I almost... How could you put me through that? Why didn't you try to contact me? Why... Didn't you let me know you were alive? I have important things to do. I wasn't even conscious. I didn't want to hurt you. Well, I wasn't conscious. But... I'm sorry, Ash. I was clinically dead. It took two years to bring me back. So much time has passed. You've moved on. I don't want to reopen old wounds. I moved on. But here you are, pulling me back in. And now we've got reports about you and Cerberus. Reports? You already knew. Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. I got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Um, I don't work for Cerberus. Cerberus and I want the same thing, to save our colony. That doesn't mean I answer to them. Do you really believe that? Or is that just what Cerberus wants you to think? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. How could you just turn your back on all of us? You betrayed the Alliance. Anderson, you betrayed me. No! No, Ash! Come on! Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. I don't trust them either, Ash. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? They what if they're the ones brought me back from the, the dead. Too hung up on Cerberus, ignoring the real threat. Ugh, I don't want to tell her she's too emotional, but... I think this is kind of tone deaf as well. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. Goodbye, Shepard. Just try to be careful. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. Well, at least we got the collector particle beam. 51,000 credits, 2,000 platinum. Trophy earned, colony defense. Achievement unlocked. Hey, James, and I saw your comment earlier. I was. I, I did see that. Yeah, I, it, it probably could have used a paragon Shepherd, interrupt good there. Good work on Horizon. Hopefully, the collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. I didn't save it's everyone. Not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony. 
and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Was that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive. Oh, jeez. And Cerberus. You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony? Just to lure the Collectors there? Bait. A calculated risk. I suspected the Collectors were looking for you, or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and Collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collectors stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 Relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you put your past relationships behind you? Yeah, cross the line there, buddy. None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, I'll leave you once behind. you find a way through the Omega-4 Relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. I guess we're really going to do it. Hit the Omega-4 relay. Not Take yet, the Jacob. fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, makes you think. We can do this. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? All right, we got a lot of assignments to do here. Go to Hastrum to get Tally. We got to go to Ilium to get Thane Krios. We got to go to Ilium to get Samara. And then we've got to go do a bunch of loyalty missions. So let's check. Still nothing here. Biotic damage. Yes, we'll take that. Yeah, we don't need that. We've already... Go. Uh, heavy skin weave, yes. Let's go talk to Joker. So, Hadley, how are you going to spend your next furlough? You really think we'll have another shore leave? Of course. Shepard's forming the best team this galaxy has ever seen. We're getting kicks in the ass. I'm sure you're right, man. Let's get all these things off the screen first. Okay. Hey, Commander. It's uh, pretty crazy the people you can run into out here, huh? I mean, it was probably a setup or something, but it was still good to see Ash, Operations Chief Williams, wasn't it? Yes. We talked, but things have changed. We let it go. Oh, good, because I was not looking forward to your mood if that went bad. There's a reason I don't date crew, Commander. I assume everything is going well up here? We're just having an argument over personalization of my workspace. Cerberus regulations are clear, Mr. Moreau. Personalization does not include grease on my bridge cameras. <laughs> it's just mad that all its footage of me looks like a dream sequence. <laughs> that's it for now. See you, Commander. Oh, that's awesome. Love it. Close that. We don't need those windows open. All right, let's go talk to Kelly. See who needs to, who, if anyone needs us. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. 
The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? It was good to see her. Do you have strong feelings for her? Yes, I do. Ashley's an incredible woman. I didn't like saying goodbye. I'm sorry. Parting ways with someone so close is never easy. I appreciate that, but I'll be okay. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Operative Lawson would like to see you at her station on the crew deck. Operative Taylor would like to see you over in the armory. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you... Commander, you've received a new Alright, let's start at the top terminal. of the ship. Make sure we feed our fish so they don't die. What? I fed the fish. I fed the fish before the last mission. Why are they dead? Oh. No. Oh, gosh. Space hamster. Squeak. I can't believe. I fed the fish. I fed him like... Oh, my gosh. That's ridiculous. Oh. oh, I don't need to go... Oh, yeah, I do. I need to go talk to Jacob. This is why I don't buy fish. I'm not sure how to romance Kelly to have her feed my fish, either. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. The yeoman said you wanted to see me. What's this about, Jacob? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I buried everything but a body. I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. Now that's interesting. Any signs that this was a Cerberus front? Who passed this to you? I doubt the elusive man would let a direct operation stake hold this long. If there's a link, it's probably just about money. Cerberus needs diverse holdings to fund projects like, well, you. <laughs> yeah. And whoever sent this my way covered their tracks. Someone could be fishing for favors, or thought it would get under my skin. Who knows with that bunch. You didn't get along with your father? He made no apologies, I'll give him that. You make a mistake, you own up to it even if you keep making it. Whatever problems we had were a lifetime ago. I've had ten years to get to where I am. And as far as I know, he's still a ghost. Tell me about the Hugo Gernsback and what it was doing. Privately held frigate. I looked over the mission brief when it disappeared. Nothing stood out. Typical research and grab operation. Find an uncharted planet, stake a claim, and establish as large a presence as you can as fast as possible to shut out competitors. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but it'll be good to close the record. You know, this mission actually reminds me of kind of the, not exactly, but a similar plot to like Star Trek Beyond. You know, where a ship goes missing and it's off for a long time. Now, I know that one was a little bit longer than just 10 years, but I don't know. This is interesting parallels there. Thank you, Commander. Rupert put the new supplies to good use. Are you guys ever going to get up? You guys have been sitting here the entire game. Miranda? Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. Well. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. 
Yes, Miranda, I do believe your outfit's a little tight, but, you know, we could fix that. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So you think your father has tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. Does your sister's family know about this? Are they okay with being relocated? They know nothing. They're completely uninvolved. Normal. I told Cerberus and they're coming up with a positive reason to move the family. What do you know about your sister? She's my genetic twin. We're identical, but she deserves a normal life and she's going to get it no matter what. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nos Astra docking bay. Okay. Let's go talk to Garrus, see if he's got anything new to say. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Of course. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. All right. Uh, I'm hoping we talk. Oh, we, let's go talk to Grunt and Jack. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open, not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info was floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. <laughs> Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Interesting. I don't usually talk to Grunt when I've played this game before, so it's interesting to talk to him. Part of the reason is I don't really find his character that interesting, but I'm going to try to be as completionist as this as I can. Hey. What do you think of Miranda and Jacob? Jacob doesn't know who he is, but that's not my problem. Miranda's a Cerberus bitch. Knew that before she opened her mouth. What do you think of our mission? I don't care. I'm out to survive it, then cut loose. I picked up a lot of resources. Can you use them to help against the collectors? I ran across the schematics for making L5X implants. Still got them in my head. You want to know what I need? 
Not usually my thing, but I've learned how to get things done on my own. Hey. Tell me about you, Jack. I'm still finding out about me. Thanks for letting me look at these files. If they're helping you, that's good enough for me. Don't be my buddy. You need me to kill for you, I need you for these files. Let's leave it there. Your friends at Cerberus are into some nasty things. I'm gonna find something I can use. Where do you I suppose... It. Where do you suppose Jack gets her lipstick and eyeshadow from? I don't see any pockets. What if the answers aren't what you expect? I'm not looking for answers. I'm looking for names, dates, places. What happens when you find what you're looking for? I go hunting. Anyone who's screwed with me pays. Their associates pay. Their friends pay. The galaxy's gonna be a lot emptier when I'm done. I won't let you go on a killing spree. I'm here for your mission. After that, what I do is my business. What's your history with Cerberus? They raised me in a research facility. I escaped Prison when I was pocket. a kid. Yeah. Been on the run ever since. Ugh, I don't know if I'd put that on my face, though. Since. But soon, I'm gonna chase them. You think about this a lot, don't you? I go to sleep with this. I wake up with it. Everyone I kill, I pretend it's the ones that did this to me. You don't have to live in this pit, you know. It's dark, quiet, and hard to find. That spells safety to me. You know, this ship is a powerhouse. You could go pirate. Live like a king. I could help. We have to stop the collectors. I don't have time for piracy. When this is done, we'll either be dead or out here in space with this ship. Think about it. Lots of creds. Freedom to go wherever you want. And all the mayhem and fighting I could want. What is it about killing that fascinates you so much? I figure every time someone dies and it's not me, my chances of survival go up. Simple. Boy, that's a cynical view of the world, Jack. I should go. Yep. Alright, Kasumi and Zai never have anything to talk about because they're DLC characters and their conversations are stupid anyway. So, I'm not going to talk to them. Okay, um, let's check our... Incoming message from Admiral oh, Steven what is this? Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Oh, this is... Yeah, that's right. I remember this now. Dr. Kenson actually doing out there? She's a deep cover operative, Shepard. We talk only when we have to. I'd heard she was investigating a rumor of a Reaper artifact in the system. Her last report uh -oh. she found it. You know what the Reaper artifacts do. What else can you tell me about the operative? Amanda's a top scientist and alliance agent working in Batarian space. It's a deadly assignment, and she's one of the few up to the challenge. She and I go back pretty far, Commander. I won't let her run away in a Batarian torture camp. I thought the Alliance denies the Reaper threat. That must be some proof she found. Kenson's team found an artifact out in Batarian space. She believes it's a Reaper device, proof that the Reapers are indeed planning to invade. 
I've known her a long time. If she says she has proof, it's worth checking out. The Batarians won't take kindly to the Alliance breaking into a secret prison. This is not an Alliance operation. It's one person going in alone to save a friend. If it were an official mission, of course the Batarians would be upset. You keep this quiet, Shepard, and there's nothing to worry about. <laughs> Famous last words. I have a hell of a squad with me. I'm sure they'd help out. Kenson is my friend. If the Batarians see a squad of armed soldiers, they'll kill her. This is serious, Commander. Go in with discretion, or don't go at all. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground at a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Bring it down the sky too. Pack it out. I do like how it's the uh, bridge, though, between the uh, between the two. Man, there's so much here. If the rip found free originally an asteroid rich in element zero omega. I just I. Uh, all this, uh, the the lore is fantastic. I, don't get me wrong; I loved all the lore. It's just, it's hard to uh, go through it all. <laughs> all right, I want to start using cryo ammo. Um, disruptor ammo just doesn't cut it. Journal. Man, we got a ton of stuff here to do. All right, we've talked to everybody. Let's go ahead and uh, let's check out our galaxy map. Horizon. What do we got here? Venture. Probe launched. Pro. Two thousand units of platinum. Got Launching lots of. Uh, this is a pretty rich planet here. Oh, now down moderate. Okay, we don't scan past moderate. Prospect. Nope, we don't scan gas giants because they're usually moderate to poor. Watchmen, let's check it out. Moderate. Nope, don't care. Alright, let's hit the mass relay. Shadow Sea. Shadow Sea was in the first game. Horizon wasn't there, though, was it? Shadow Sea had, I think, is that where the Century? I think that's where Century is, right? That was the system, or is that the Maroon Sea? I can't remember. Okay. We want, there's not a lot of stuff opened up yet. We can help Jacob over here. Recruit Tally here. Phoenix Massey is where Project Overlord starts. Hourglass Nebula is 100%. Titan Nebula is 100%. Eagle Nebula is 100%. This Mar Frontier. Yeah, we'll do that towards the end. Let's, let's go to... Um, we'll get ourselves ready to go to Ilium. Okay. Um... I'm going to go ahead and stop the playthrough here. I'm going to take a quick bio break, uh, get something to eat, and then I'll be back probably in about 20, let's say 20, 30 minutes. Um, I'll plan on kicking 
kicking back up with part six. I did want to make this video mostly just about Horizon and it'd be a good natural break point. So uh, it's about 1040 here for me. So let's say between 11 and 1115 uh, Central Time, I will, uh, I'll, be, I'll be back and we'll start up with part six. So um, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to my channel for more content, especially Mass Effect content. And I will talk to you later. See you guys.